Hey, what's going on? Happy uh, Thursday night, uh, Friday morning, whenever you might uh, watch this. Um, Bob and I actually uh, just got back from uh, watching Unplanned, uh, which is the uh, the bio uh, movie, by uh, the biography movie about uh, Abby Johnson, and um, uh, Abby Johnson, who was uh, the youngest director of a Planned Parenthood affiliate in uh, the history of organization. Um, she um, served uh, with Planned Parenthood for eight years, and uh, this is uh, kind of the story of how she got involved and what she experienced as a part of Planned Parenthood, and then uh, what she saw on a, a specific day that really just changed her life, changed her view on what she was doing, and uh, led to a huge change in, uh, in culture. Uh, Abby's a very strong woman and is really... Um, spent the last number of years fighting against uh, some of the uh, the deceit and uh, just the deception that goes on in our society and uh, from Planned Parenthood. So uh, the movie is very well done. Um, people think, oh, it's by a Christian uh, outfit, Pure Flix. Uh, they're going to automatically discount it. Don't. It's really a very uh, a solid movie. Um, the, the quality of the film, the acting is very, uh, very good. Uh, just as a warning, the R rating, despite some people a little bit upset about it, thinking that it's a political move, Bobby and I both think that maybe the, uh, the R rating is justified because in the first 30 minutes there are some pretty um, tough images um, having to do with abortion, having to do with uh, some of the aftermath of abortion. Uh, so in the first 30 minutes there are some pretty hard images so if you're really squeamish, if you're really um, not comfortable with, uh, with blood and, and things like that, I just want to give you that warning. The R rating is probably justified uh, because uh, they, it, it's not gore, it's not gratuitous, it's real. They are trying with this movie to show you the reality of abortion, the reality of what Planned Parenthood is doing, and with that reality... Unfortunately, reality is not pretty. Uh, so just be warned. Don't think that because it is a pure flex, because it is a Christian movie, that it's all going to be butterflies and rainbows. It's not. This is a movie about abortion. It gets real. So just be warned. Now that that warning is out of the way, I do want to tell you that everybody needs to go see this. Pro-choice, pro-life, on the fence, either one way, go see Unplanned. And then think... Am I, if you're pro-choice, think, am I truly on the moral high ground being pro-choice? Or is maybe what Abby went through more reality than what the rest of society wants us to think? So I highly encourage you. In fact, if you're pro-choice or if you're somebody that shouts your abortion, I actually, I dare you to go see the movie and and, and then ask yourself, is being so pro-choice really the right answer for abby and many like her including the 500 plus people that have escaped the abortion industry and escape is a good word because you'll see and you probably understand that the political power of an organization that's backed by george soros is backed by bill gates is backed by all these billionaires you can just imagine how powerful they are and the politics that are behind this. Anybody that leaves the abortion industry is truly escaping. Uh, so I highly encourage everybody to go see the movie, no matter what side of the fence you are. It's not a political film. It's just a biography about Abby uh, Johnson and her uh, time with Planned Parenthood. So go see Unplanned. It's in theaters. We got to see it tonight. Uh, a few select theaters had it uh, opening tonight. This is opening weekend. Go out and see it. It's well done. It's a very good story. And I hope, and I, I pray, and uh, my wife Bobby also prays that, that this movie can help get the conversation going because there is no coincidence. There is no coincidence that in the same year that New York's abortion bill passed and in the same year that Virginia's governor talks about killing a baby that survived an abortion, there's no coincidence that this movie came out this year. It's God's plan. We believe that. And we believe that the conversation needs to be had. And we believe that people need to see what abortion really is. It's not about choice. It's, it's about 
a living being and we hope that the conversation will start and start in earnest and we hope that if you truly believe in shout your abortion or or in pro choice that you go see the movie because if you're so solid in your 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 footing uh, on that moral high ground then you have nothing to fear about this movie so why not go find out and see what really happens behind those closed doors so it was really well done movie it's not an entertaining movie um because of the topic is so heavy and again the first 30 minutes are very tough don't eat popcorn so yeah it's kind of funny but in seriousness it's probably not a movie you want to snack through um but i do want to encourage you go see it unplanned in theaters the actual opening day is tomorrow uh, a couple of theaters had it tonight so i encourage you unplanned the story of abby johnson mm-hmm. and then get the information get the story and then see what what may or may not change in you so hey mary beth gill sluss thanks for popping on the video i'm about to end hope you have a great night and if you can mary anybody else go see unplanned uh, but again warning the r rating is legit so may not be great for kids your teenagers maybe because they're going to see worse than that on video games but kids definitely not definitely not but thanks for watching and i hope this helps good night